Compiègne is a beautiful city about an hour outside of Paris. It's a bustling suburb alongside the Oise River that somehow still maintains a calmness all its own. I am already falling in love. People sit on cafe terraces on sunny days, women bring their rolling baskets to the supermarket, young people ride their bikes through town, joking with each other as they go, and couples stroll together down the street with fresh baguettes in hand. The concentration of macarons in one single city is the highest I've ever experienced, and I find myself swooning a little each time I pass a patisserie, with their beautiful cakes and pastries sitting in the windows like works of art, seemingly too perfect to eat. Cathedrals older than the entire United States watch over the city, waiting with open doors for people to enter and be humbled by their holy beauty. There's a lush, sprawling forest which surrounds the southeast portion of town, perfect for hikes and lazy picnics on Saturday afternoons. I've spent more time lounging on the grass than ever before in my life. It is truly lovely here. I've only been here for a few weeks, but my communication abilities have increased exponentially, though it's now easier for me to understand people more than it is to actually speak to them. Hopefully those skills will equalize again with a few more weeks of immersion. Many people have the impression that the French are a snobby and exclusive people, but as far as I've seen, this is a largely incorrect stereotype. People here are very welcoming, accommodating, and patient. Neighbors and strangers alike greet each other in the street more often than they do in the United States. I think it's easy to forget that the world round, we're all human. Even if our cultures and languages differ, our experiences are often very similar. It's interesting being an observer of this town. I shared a moment with a panini in one of the best cafe crumbs I've ever experienced a few weeks ago, and thought a lot about how the things that cause me wonder and curiosity are simply parts of daily life for the citizens of Compiègne. Did they realize just how beautiful their town is, with its ivy-adorned houses and wonderfully quaint streets? Before coming to France, I told my mother that I always thought that there was a part of me that was European, and the speed at which this place is beginning to feel like a new home only confirms that. The serenity I feel here makes me wonder if this place is where I've belonged all along. Only time will tell.